What up my dudes, it's Malik here from Run the Cast and today we're out here in the Galveston Bay. We're gonna head out deep sea fishing and we're here with our bros right here. Say what's up. Hey. What up there we go. Let's see how it goes. Y el otro, el otro. It's a, it's a video. <laughs> There we go, video, video. Hey, funny guy. There we go. He's extra funny. Extra funny guy. Extra funny guy. All right, folks, let me go ahead and explain to you what's going to happen. So this is a 12 hour deep sea fishing trip. And the way this works is we're going to be riding on this boat for four hours into the sea and then fish at multiple spots that they have marked on their map and then fish for four hours and then come back. The target species for today is vermilion snapper. And of course, it's my, there might be other species like cobias, lane snappers and red snappers, of course. But sadly, it's not the season for red snappers, so we can keep those. So what we're going to try to do is catch our limit on the vermilion snappers and do a catch, clean, and cook. Before we get into the fishing part of the video, let me go ahead and show some clips that I thought looked awesome. And also, let me tell you that I'm not going to be talking too much during the videos because there was a lot of wind and it kept like messing up my voice, so I'm not going to include those. But these clips that I'm about to show you, I thought they looked really awesome, so I hope you enjoy them. And let's roll the clips.
so we've got the anchor right here. This is our spot. This is my rod right here. Let's see. So we've got 12 ounce weight right here. Some squid, some sardines, and uh, two bucks, I believe. Yeah. Oh, this is one hug. Oh, here's another one. Here we go. Two hugs. And a nice little rod. Hopefully it goes good. Hey, I wonder what Ezra's doing. I know. We're waiting for it, bro. I'm gonna go get him from upstairs. <laughs> Alright, man. There we go. There goes the anchor. Look how long it takes for it to fall down. Baits are down. I don't even know. I don't even know if I have a fish on. Let's see. He got a fish on. Look. He, he's got a fish on. Holy shit. Ready? Bro, already? Oh, my bro's got one. There we go. Oh, I got one. Oh, I got a bite. Ah, that was a bite. Come on, Get come up. on, bro. Come on. You got it. Oh, I'm getting bites. I'm getting big bites. There we go. Got him. Oh damn. He's swimming to the surface. Oh, the red one. First one. There we go. Go up. There we go, first red. What is it? Red snapper. How oh, you take it out? There we go. All right. There we go. Look at that baby snapper. There we go. First one of the day. Look at this guy. Double right here. Look at that beautiful red snapper, but sadly we can't keep him. We're gonna return it back to the water. There we go, come on. Come on. Fish on. Ah, look. La camera, la camera. There we go. Double snapper. Double, Double snapper. snapper. Triple. Ese está muerto. Oh, damn. Pull him up, pull him up. Yeah, bro. Oh, God damn, bro. Oh, a double. What a mess. Look at that mess right there. Alright, my dudes, we're on another spot. Here with my bro. There we go. They said to use small pieces because we're going for a vermilion snapper. Or lane snapper and vermilion. So, probably like this small of a bait would be nice so we're just waiting for the anchor to go down and then we'll start fishing such a beautiful view you ready Alright my dudes, so quick update. We've been to about three spots and we haven't had a lot of luck. We've only caught a bunch of red snappers, as you can see here. And we probably caught like eight snappers, me and my bros all together and um, no keepers at all. The reason why I think that is is because there was a bunch of dolphins around and they were probably going after the vermilion since they're smaller fish. Or they probably were scaring away the fish, you know, in general. Another thing is that I recorded in all these three spots, which is probably like 30 minutes each. So I drained my battery really quickly and I couldn't show you the action when I caught the keeper fish. But here in the next oh, nice. scenes, I'm still gonna show you the fish. It's pretty yeah. awesome. Come to try to eat it. Yeah, yeah, I see it. I'll finish the job, there you go. Hey, fresh keeper, nice. You got it. <laughs> Random casts. Random casts? Yes. Don't forget the on it, bro. The, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta have that sound effect. Let's see. Show it to the camera. Oh, look at that. Vermilion, right? Yes, sir. 
Got it. Nice little keeper. Ah, there you go. Nice little keeper. Ah, there you go. It's a keeper. It's a keeper. Yeah, I'm telling you, it's a keeper. Keeper time. Keeps. Nice little keeper. Look at that. Beautiful fish. Nay, nay. Let's put him on the string here. I'm gonna double up right now. Watch. I'm gonna double up now, bro. Double up. Double up, bro. All right, all right.
Zoe. Mm. All right, folks. I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did making it. I really did have a blast out there with my bros out there in the boat. It was really good. It was really nice. Um, the beginning was scary kind of because of the fog and all that. But at the end, uh, the weather started to clear up a little bit. So we did have a really nice day. The food was really nice. Um, we helped out each other. My sister, my mom, my dad, and I. We put a little bit of um, work onto the cooking part of the video and all that. Um, but it, it was a really nice meal. Nice dinner, actually, yeah, dinner. I'm sorry guys if the, if the video is a little bit distorted or blurry. It's because I lost the, the clips right here on my phone, so I had to go and back them up from my uh, Google Photos. So I had to download it back into my phone and that kind of distorted the videos. So um, I don't know, if it came out a little bit distorted, please comment down below or something like that. I try my best to not do it again. And also guys, I know I jumped really quickly from bio fishing to deep sea fishing. So um, honestly, the the trip was just the last minute thing kind of. kind of. Um, my brother told me one week earlier, like, hey, we're going to go to the boat. So get your stuff ready. And I was like, oh man, let's go. But um, honestly, it wasn't like something that I actually planned for it like well you know like i didn't take all my batteries with me with the gopro camera i mean not the gopro but the the little action camera um but uh next time that we go because we are planning to go again probably next month or something like that uh next time we go i am gonna go even more prepared and i have done more research on deep sea fishing because I don't usually go deep sea fishing, but this time that I went, uh, I don't know, I just felt like the weight was a little bit too heavy for that kind of fishing. So, um, but um, I'm going to go and I'm going to make my own leaders and I'm going to take him and I might just take my own rod as well. But let's just see how it goes. Let's hope we can head out there once more, uh, probably next month, like my brother said, and uh, we'll be more prepared. If you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and leave a like. And also, if you haven't subscribed yet, please consider doing so. It's going to help the channel a lot. Also, don't forget to hit that bell button and comment down below what you want to see next. Or what I did wrong in the video as well. Any opinion is, is taken here and I can learn a bunch from you guys or from anybody. And um, I'll try to improve. By any means, I'm not a good fisherman at all. I'm barely starting doing fishing and stuff like that. I enjoy filming, so and I enjoy fil uh, fishing. So... I decided to put it together, but I'm not so good at it, but there's a lot of time to improve So if you guys saw something that I did wrong, please don't don't feel bad for mentioning it I'll just take take point of it and try to uh, do it better with that being said guys Take care out there, and I'll see you guys in the next video peace it goes, uh, sure that First thing First thing that happens on that cool. Yep, that's exactly what I did. Oh my god, exactly what I did. Oh, you yep, got the lift of YouTube. I don't usually use baitcasters. I was actually.